hello my beautiful people welcome welcome back to my youtube channel if this is your first time watching a video on this channel i want to encourage you to get like the subscribe button because this particular update i want to share is going to be concerning for subsidy and the current price of 50 kg bag of rice this is a very very interesting and vital information to all nigerians so subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out any of our vital information so concerning the fuel subsidy a lot of people has been um confused that is the fuel subsidy actually back so this um video is going to clear your doubt if the fuel subsidy is truly back or not so this video is going to clear your doubt so recently um the imf fine actually confirms return of fuel subsidy under president bola Ahmed Tinubu administration but there are still more details and explanation because Nigeria received shocking news over fuel subsidy hem nationwide protest and i'm going to show you their reaction to this news so if this is your first time watching a video on this channel please hit the subscribe button and i'll be grateful for that so there has been a wave of mixed reaction following the international momentary funds confirmations that the nigerian federal government has resumed paying subsidy on premium motor spirit which is the pms commonly known as petrol through indirect means so during this integration on may 29 which on 2023 which is just last year president bola Ahmed announced the termination of the petrol subsidy a move that resulted in significant price hikes for food and services across the country in nigeria precisely so in the subsequent week the central bank of nigeria which is the cbn unified the various exchange rate regimes leading to a depreciation of the um naira as of monday the exchange rate stood at naira 1499 per dollar in the official market and naira 1515 naira per dollar in the parallel market so earlier this week, the IMF released a statement concluding its executive board's post-financing assessment with Nigeria. The IMF raised concern about the government's decision to cap fuel prices at the retail stations and advised the administration to fully eliminate petrol subsidies to free up funds for other governmental needs. So, according to research and according to my own point of view, following the removal of the petrol subsidy in May 2023, pump price immediately rose from 815, 800, um, 1, 000, oh, sorry, 185 naira per liter to 400 per liter and later moved to 568 naira per liter at NNPC fueling station with some location charging over 600 naira per liter. Reports indicated that the landing cost of petrol has increased potentially pushing the retail price to 1000 naira per liter. So investigation by the research I made and according to reports, the federal government paid naira 169.4 billion in subsidies to maintain the pump prices at naira 620 per liter this is very very crazy a document from the federal account allocation committee which is the faac obtained by reporters showed that in august 2023 the nigerian liquefied natural gas paid 275 million dollars as divided to nigerian via nnpc limited hmm. of this amount nnpc limited allocated 220 million dollars which is equivalent to 169.4 billion at naira 770 sorry 770 naira per dollar to cover the pms subsidy while retaining 550 million dollars so this is crazy. So as I'm speaking to you, there is no any confirmed news that says the fuel subsidy has been um has been returned as of now. Everything is still as it is. So don't be deceived. So let's move to the second 
update that has been confusing people because um the the, the um the, the Nigerian government actually said as of now there are places that bag of rice is being sold at forty thousand naira, fifty thousand naira, and um to seventy thousand naira. So let's get into the details and explanation to see if it's actually true or not because we don't share fake news. Yeah, our our motive here is to give you guys accurate news and any news that is confusing, we break it down into uh, um, understandable means. So the federal government has announced that Nigeria can now get a 50 kg bag of rice at 50% discounts in some place across the country. So what they mean is that if they are selling the bag of rice, for example, in your area at 80,000 Naira, a 50% discount slash is means that the, they will be selling it at the half of that um, original price. So that means if it's sold for 80,000 Naira, it will now be sold for 14,000 um, Naira right now. So the government made this known on Monday in a statement made available to the newsmen by the Minister of Information and National Orientation, Mohamed Idris, at the end of Monday Federal Executive Council meeting in Abuja. So according to him, a 50 kg bag of rice has been reduced by 50 percent, that's to 40,000 naira. Therefore, Nigeria will pay half of 80,000 naira to get a 50 kg bag of rice. He asserted that the reduction of of rice price come aim the recent release of 20 truck to the product to various state governors for distribution to Nigeria. There is also rice that is being sold at about 50% of its cost. A bag of rice being sold as we speak now. The rice has been taken to various centers across all the states of the Federation and it's being sold at 40,000 Naira per 50 kg bag. Centers have been created so that those who need the rice can go there and buy it at 40,000 Naira per bag. So, you know, after when uh, this information popped up, when um, the um, Mohammed Idris actually dropped this information, I had to quickly rush to a center where they are selling bag of rice in my area to confirm if truly the, the price of buy, um, bag of rice has actually reduced, but it was still the same. So if you are living in an area where it has been reduced, please kindly confirm and help other people get the information more clearly because I try to confirm within the area I'm staying, it was still sold as the normal price. So if you know you are living in an area where it has been slashed truly, please confirm that in the comment section because all we have gone to right now as I'm speaking, they are still sold at the normal price. For so I want you to go to the comment section and share your opinion concerning what you think. Because what I do is that whenever I get um vital information concerning politics, I try to break them down in easy understanding means so that you guys can get information right and also share um correct comments. So avoid sharing each speech comment because it might be deleted immediately by YouTube or it might be deleted by me. So you not feel that you are not part of the scenario two four seven family. Have a great day ahead. Bye.